The only color I care about is green, money. Now you've certainly made some money so far, Freak, but it's time we make more money. I'm talking movies, TVs, endorsements, even your own brand Jordan sneakers. I care about the game fighters, Dom. All that sounds great, but don't you think it's a little too early to be talking about all that? Too early? LeBron was 12 years old in sixth grade when he was thinking Space Jam. It's never too early to take and make leaps. I guess. You guess? This isn't high school, this isn't college, this is the real world. And the real world is fueled by one thing. Oh, money. That's right, money, dollar bills, y'all. Why do you think they put presidents on them? Because that's what presides over us. I ever tell you guys about the first dollar I ever made? No, Dom, but you're about to. Yo, check this out. CC, it's a great story, right? So I'm seven years old, Queens, New York, 1973. My older brother Lonzo, he's got a lemonade stand. So that summer, I'm like, Lonzo, you know, let me help out. Let me make a couple of bucks with you. He's like, all right, Dom, come on. I'll teach you the business. So I'm pouring tons of sugar. I'm squeezing the lemons. I got the lemonade stand all set up. I'm like, yo, I got this, right? So I'm watching during the course of the day. I'm noticing something Lonzo's doing. He's not charging for refills. That summer, I convinced Lonzo, no more free refills, and we make $2,000 plus tips. Today, Lonzo's Lemonade is a national brand and publicly traded. Oh, wow, that's dope. I'm not here to impress. I'm here to improve and to assist. I'm like the Italian-American Magic Johnson, running point for Team Freak. No, 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 no. <laughs> The only person running point around here will be me. CC. <laughs> Look at my watch, what do you see? Not this again, I've seen the movie. This is diamonds and platinum. Gold, forget about it. Silver, forget about it. This is diamonds and platinum. It's power and speed, freak, this is what you have. You are on your way to being the biggest thing in the NBA. I'm proposing now that we dominate off the court as well as on. I can't believe I'm saying this, Freak, but Dom has a point. You've been establishing yourself on the court and now it's time to take it off the court. Brand Jordan sneakers, I mean, the possibilities are endless. Listen, Freak, you're gonna have to decide the legacy you wanna leave. But I'm not some agent from the Yellow Pages. I'm Dom Pagnotti. I'm the man, the myth, the legend, the king number one. I'm the best, and I'm a shark. And the Pagnotti shark is working for you. And we gotta set new goals and bigger goals, okay? I'm talking all-star game. I'm talking dunk contest. When was the last time you saw an NBA great in a dunk contest, huh? I'm talking first team all NBA, first team all defensive team. What about social media? Yvette, great idea, social media. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, let's kick it up a notch. www.freakinginviving.com. That's right, your own website. I've already set it up for you and it's running great. Wait, hold okay. up. Listen, I'm in negotiations right now on a feature that will allow viewers to watch Freak and only him and his plays during the game. Yeah, but you set up a website without consulting me? Yeah. When did this happen? Last week. Uh-oh, oh, this is gonna be epic. CC. I love you, but I got no time to waste, and you're out there busy doing whatever it is you're doing. Whatever I'm doing? You know what? I'm really sick and tired of the disrespect. This is Team Freak, not the Dom Pagnotti I Italian American Opera. Cece, calm down, all right? Dom here, he's just trying to take us to the next level. Look, Ming Ching, I don't even know why you're here when your job is to look good and shut up. Cece, chill. No, I'm done chilling. Between your clown agent and your gold digging girlfriend, I've had enough. Gold digger? You're the winner of the Lucky Sperm Contest, and I'll have you know I am currently starting my own fashion line. I've already got model contracts from Beijing to Milan, not to mention I graduated top of my class. Summa cum laude. You mean thank you, laude? I don't need a man to save me or provide for me, okay? I got my own, boo. Mm, okay, well, if that's the case, then why has all your success and fame coincided with your relationship with my brother? I mean, if you're really on top of your game, wouldn't that have happened before y'all even met? <laughs> Right? You know what, Cece? You're just jealous. It's okay, though. Why don't you just play the background, yeah? Enjoy the ride. Y'all both done yet? May I continue? Now listen, as far as movie properties go, I've already got a script based upon a story of your life, Freak, okay? So guys, check out these possible titles. Freaking and Vibin', Life and Times, Volume 1. The Freak Chronicle, Freak the Fast and Furious, Part 1 does it, and this one's my favorite Freak, you're gonna love this. He got Pagnotti. <laughs> Oh, you okay. love it, right? right? Dom, 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 Dom. Yeah, yeah, but look, you're the man, but you're not the man. Okay, you work for me. You have to follow my lead. I'm all for your ideas, but in due time. As for now, I want to focus on the court, and we'll discuss some of your ideas at a later date, understood? Yeah, we're cooling the gang, bro. That's all you got to say. All right, good. Thank you. Vet, chill. You cannot let Cece get underneath your skin. But on the same token, you cannot go out of your way to piss her off. I don't have time to be playing peacekeeper between you two. You know what, we need to talk about this afterwards alone. Fine. Cece? Cece? 
you need to hold this together. You and I both agreed long ago that Don was the best agent for me. He has delivered. Are his methods questionable? Is he a shark? Yes and yes, but he's our shark. He's what's best for me, which means he is what's best for all of us. Your job is to bring us balance. Manage the team, sis. We all need to be on the same page. You're right, but blood is thicker than water. You know, I ain't trying to hear all that. I'm not here to hold hands. I'm here to win games and achieve greatness on and off the court. But in order for that to happen, I need everybody, everybody to be on point. Essentially, get right or get gone. Yeah, I don't have time to be teaching you guys how to work together. It either starts now or I find it elsewhere. Squashed? Squashed. Squashed. Zucchini. Mr. Dom Pagnotti. Uh, Mr. Diamond and Platinum himself. It's a love-hate relationship. What are you thinking about people who see your brother as just a meal ticket? <laughs> well, that's why I'm there. I'm the gatekeeper. Yep. I, I can smell it from a mile away. When you take time out of your own personal life, do you have a personal life? I do. Where at? I just... I think Freak is your personal life. You can think whatever you want, Mr. But um, I have a personal life, thanks. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. I think that should end the interview right now. Yeah? It's great meeting you. I told you, Don Pagnotti always delivers. Brand Jordan Freak prototypes. Open the box, check Man. them out. <laughs> my Christmas and my birthday on the same day. Oh. Oh, Don. You love them? Uh, I love them. Hey, Ooh. they're waiting for your approval for production. Uh, approved. Approved? Uh, approved. Done. <laughs> I'll make the call. <laughs> In fact, not if we trust. I told oh, you you'd love him. Man. Hey, I'm gonna have you playing in those in 30 days or less. Oh, money. Oh man. <laughs> freaking it vibing. Hey. Freaking it vibing. <laughs> freaking it vibing in these baby. As I was saying, we got a real big problem, all this kitty stuff, you evil twin CC and Dom got you doing a uh vet. What, what was that word he was using? Uh, rebrand? No, 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 no. Um, recalibrate. All this stuff they got you doing to recalibrate your image just cost you in the hood, fam. Yo, the streets is watching, and they're not convinced. Vic, how many times do I have to tell you? The streets ain't always right. No, 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 no. It's always good in the hood. Uh, let's not forget, I am a student of human nature. All right, mm. take your man here. He's playing his hair video game is to not address the reason why his brand Jordan sneakers are sitting on store shelves collecting dust. Ooh. Ouch. Okay, what are your suggestions, Victor? He wants you to rob a bodega. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look, man, I'm not talking about some focus group, all right? Uh -huh. I'm talking about the hood. They don't trust you no more. They see you coming to the arenas wearing them tight pants y'all ballers be wearing. Your high water ankles be showing. Your pants is just so tight, man. It, your ankles be choking. <clears throat> Air it out some. People don't see themselves in you anymore. Look at me. People don't recognize themselves in who you are. Okay, you want to recalibrate? Fine, B, go ahead. But recalibrate back to Harlem. Remind these fools where you from. Represent, you know what I'm saying? Like, where's that Jesus piece you used to rock? Not that, that shuttle's work. With them fake chains we used to wear. Yo, but that's my point. Yo, let me get you some nice jewels, huh? Make it flossy. Get you a new whip, something that the hood would love. Let's remind these fools that you the Harlem Renaissance up in this piece. Get a club, I don't know, something. Just throw your weight around, man. I mean, at least get me some, too. Yeah, and get some nice free vet, too. Nah, but for real, in all seriousness, you think it's that bad? Yo. Cats be laughing at your corner commercials, B. Come on. But that's what I'm saying. Yo, we could change all that. Hey, right? now I know CC's your manager and all, but everywhere she leads, you can't always follow. Now, I'm not trying to catch no charge, but CC got people out here laughing at you, fam. Now, just let me take care of everything. You the CEO, I'm the CFO, Chief Flossing Officer. You hit me with that bread, and I got you. CC. How y'all doing? What up, CC? Freak, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, what up? 
and private? Cece, go ahead. Okay, well, I thought we were supposed to be having a private meeting today to discuss business. Cece, what you think we're doing? Am I talking to you? <laughs> you know what? Y'all ain't talking business. Y'all talking nonsense. We were actually discussing the questionable nature of the promotional strategy that you and Dom have employed on Freak's behalf. Now, it doesn't necessarily resonate with his core fan base, primarily due to the fact that it negates the legitimacy of his personal background and history in favor of reaching a larger, primarily more disinterested demographic that would prefer to judge Freak's past as opposed to appreciate it. <laughs> Yo, what Yvette said, four times 25, 100. Oh, so now you know your times tables. Yvette, occasionally proving that you're articulate doesn't mean you have business acumen. Beyond, of course, your clear mastery of basic arithmetic, we all know you can add up how much Freak makes. Okay, Cece, that's enough. <laughs> no, you know what, Cece? You're absolutely Anywho, right. Freak, and the reason... speaking of basic arithmetic, how much of Freak's money do you take? Okay, I mean, what, did I I what? what did I just say about Team Freak? A manager? What did I just say about no. Team Freak? The only right. members of Good. Team Freak in here are me and you. Oh, you know what, Cece? This isn't the womb, okay? It's not just you and Freak. Speaking of, how's that going for you? Hey, come on. Oh, snap! You gonna let hey. her talk to me Yo, like that, really? You need to check on me. Yo, check her now. Yeah. Yo, I'm out. You know what? I think I'm I'll out. join oh, you. No, 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 darlings, please, please have a seat. I would just love to hear what you all were just discussing. Better yet, let me guess. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, yo, I'm saying, dude, what you need to do is hit up these parties. Yeah, you need to show these fools how you still have mad love for the hood. Get you some flossy jewels. Make sure every time they see you whistling the new whip. Better yet, let's get us a dealership or a club or something. Never mind that house you promised your twin sister you promised you get for your parents who are still in the projects where you left them. Yo, that's not fair. I ain't leaving my ass. Hey, and you know I'll never leave my parents in projects. Thing, fam. I'll take care of everything. All you got to do is break me off with that bread. Yeah, that's what I thought. Wow. You know what, Cece? I don't know what's going on with you tonight, but I think it's best you go home. We will continue our meeting here. You asking me to leave? Yes. Hey, yo, freak. It's all good, man. As a matter of fact, Cece, I know you don't like me. You never have. Now, I don't know what I ever did to you. But at this point, does it really matter anymore? Look, I just want you to know that I'm really sorry. But whatever it was, I can honestly say it was not intentional. Right? Hey, you're free. Think about what I said earlier, man. I ain't trying to catch no charge. Vet, you ready? Let's bounce. So you see. Okay, you know I love you more than life itself. And how come you always put them before me? I don't put anyone above you, not even myself. You sure about that, Cece? What would you just call all this? I mean, you come in here blowing up my spot and you insult my brother? He's not our brother. You disrespect my woman. <laughs> just trying to protect you. From who? From the likes of you? But you don't think I realize that I have vultures and blood-sucking leeches in my life? Don't think I realize that you're one of them? Blood-sucker? Yeah, but you know what? That's what I think the problem is. It's because you realize you know better than them and you're ashamed. But in fact, you're worse because we share the same blood. And just because they don't have the same blood running through their veins as us, doesn't mean that they don't love me. Yeah, their love might be flawed, but it's true. What you need to understand is I don't need you to protect me anymore. I don't mind the people closest to me leeching off me. Yes, you do leech off me, and I leech off you too. You love business and you love me. I use that. Vic? Uh, Vic? You know you don't mind running these streets. He's my connection to things I don't want to deal with anymore, so I let him do him. I take care of him, and in return, he looks out for me in places you know you can. And as much as you don't want to hear this, Yvette, 
She is the eye of the storm in my life right now. She is my only calm. She's my peace, my shelter. I use these people and they use me. I just don't call it that, CC. I don't call what you do using me. I call what you do caring for me. Forgive yourself and forgive them for using the resources at their disposal to get what they need. And what you need to learn to do is just trust me. Okay, I've always had a good judge of character, even before I was born. Remember? Because I chose to come in this world with you. That's right. It was me and you in the womb just kicking it. Right? Right? I was born first. <laughs> yeah, you were. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Swish.